first question, please. Tarantula on the mic. Well, Jalen, uh, congratulations on that victory. Uh, all smiles here. So what's your initial thoughts after that performance? I didn't hear half the thing you just said, but I'm happy to be here. Overall pleased with uh, the performance, I guess. You know, I'm, I'm 90% pleased. I'm mad how he took me down. I'm mad that he cracked me a couple times. But besides that, you know, it wasn't a flawless victory, but it was a victory nonetheless. So when he took you down and he said he cracked you, did, he, did anything in there surprise you that he brought to the table? I was, I was surprised how tough he was. Like, I knew it was going to be tough, but I, I hit him hard. And I was like, how are you still standing, bro? Like, bro, like, like, what are you doing? So that surprised me the most. Um, his durability was just crazy through the roof, you know. Uh, it was expected. That right hand you landed against the fence that put him down, have you ever landed a cleaner punch than that in a professional fight? I don't even remember the punch to tell you the answer to that, but, you know, it felt good. You know, I got a little, uh, I think I chipped something on my fingers, and my fingers are a little bloody from that, probably from that punch, so, yeah. How, how soon do you want to get back in there? And now, at this point in your career, you're on this win streak. Can you start eyeing specific names, or are you just going to take them as they come in this division? You know, I'm going to take them as they come. I was thinking of a call-out, but, you know, I'm not that kind of guy. I'm a businessman, so whatever the promotion wants me to do, whoever they want to line me up with, I'm there for it. And you even tweeted, you don't know how you get down to this weight class. Is it getting harder for you at this point, or is it still, like, just at this point in your career, you can still make it easy? I can still make it, but it's getting harder. I'm not going to lie. Last one, uh, yeah, I made it, but, you know, it just, it just sucks, you know. I love food too much. I love, you know, in, 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 in <laughs> endeavoring myself in food, whatever, sweets, candy, like, I, that's just my life, you know. I'm not the um, perfect athlete diet-wise, I guess you could say sometimes. So, yeah, yeah, it's, it's getting there, but I don't think, uh, I don't see myself moving up anytime soon. Um, the motorways is big. They'd be like 200 pounds, 190-something walking in, fight night, you know. You're taller than the two men in the main event. That's true. That's, that is true. <laughs> See, look, okay, here's my thing. Look, I, I don't mind. I train with a lot of, like, heavier fighters anyway. So I, I'll bang with them. Like, that's fine. But it's the grappling. Like, if I had to do, like, five rounds of grappling with, so, like, somebody that's 10, 15 pounds heavier than me, that's where it's going to, like, it's going to be downhill. There's no point. So that's why I make the cut. Finally, immediately, I think you did surprise people with when you were talking about your skateboarding career. Uh, did people online, like, were they surprised? Did the skate community reach out to you and such? Did you get any DMs about it? Oh, yeah. I got a lot of love from that. I love the skate community. You know, um, skateboarding was my first passion. You know, that was the first thing I wanted to do. Um, I, I still got my tricks, you know. My, my knee's a little busted up right now, so I don't think I'm going to be on the board anytime soon. But, uh, yeah, man, uh, you know, you just once a skater, always a skater. It just never goes away. Jalen, over here, were you confident that you could win on the feed? Uh, yeah, I'm always confident I could win on the feed. What kind of, yes, yes. I don't, I don't feel like there's many people that, that can beat me on the feed. And the fact that, like, I, J J no, like, I'm not turning him down, like, I'm not putting him down. But Jamie Larkey is tough, and he came and he cracked me a couple times, and I did not expect it to be like that. So, I, like, I cats off to him for that. So what's your thoughts on the Rogan Inu coin? I know you mentioned it uh, after your fight. I, are you involved with the organizers? What's your, what's your interest in it? Yeah, I'm involved with them. Uh, Marsh Rogan Inu, uh, we've been in the works. Uh, we've been talking about some stuff. So, yeah, it's been, it's been cool. Who are the main founders? Sure, I don't know. You, I, can, <laughs> I can't even tell you. But, you know, they're they helping me out, so I'm helping them out. That's, that's how I grow. All right, I like that. And who do you want next? And... We, 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 we're not calling names. Whoever they want to put me up against. All right, thanks. Congrats. Thank you. Hey, Jalen. Congratulations. Um, you know what? At this stage of your career, what are you most proud of in how you've grown as a martial artist, especially now getting this win streak going in the big show? Um, I'm proud of how I'm able to handle this lifestyle, how I'm able to um, balance my family time, my training um, while remaining focused on the tasks at hand. You know, it's always a lot to, to balance. Um, I drive a lot just to train. So it, it gets hard, it gets hectic, especially uh, during camp. It's like I, I hardly see my kids sometimes. And um, before, like, like a year ago, I would, like, if you asked me to, like, do anything when I was in camp, I wouldn't, I would just zone in. I wouldn't do anything. I wouldn't do anything fun. 
I was a Grinch. I wouldn't go places. I was just like, no, I got to fight. I can't do anything. So, like, this camp, like, I was just like, you know what? Like, I know what I have to do. I'm putting my work in. Uh, I feel good. I, I ended up buying a puppy. I flew to Philadelphia to go get pick up my puppy. You know, I, a year ago, I would have never done that. You know, so I'm just enjoying the life. You know, that's, that's uh, helped me a lot. I help, um, I'm happy that I've grown that way. Does the puppy get along with all the tarantulas and spiders at the house? <laughs> no, uh -uh, not at all. He's, he stays away from them. Uh, one of my uh, colleagues wanted to ask, how do you feel about a potential matchup with someone like Brad Riddell? <laughs> Man, I, you know, that's, I like them because that was the name that was in my head, but you know, I'm not a call out guy, but damn, they, they got that one on the mark. That's it. That's all I got to say. You know, I, I don't, I don't know what it is with me and the like the Aussies and the Islanders out there, but you know, like we, I, there's no beef on my end, but like, you know, we just keep that that ball rolling if that's what it is. <laughs> one last one. What is it about that Southern California team that just makes it a good fit for you specifically? Um, man, my my team's right there. You know, that's that's my team. That's my coaches. That's everything I need right there. Um, they're like family to me. It's not just. Like, wherever they go, I'm going to go. You know, I, if it's in Alaska, I'm following them, you know. Uh, they got me to this point. Um, they all have played the part, and they all are a big help. Um, I also have affiliate gyms like Millennium MMA. Um, you know, they all help me out. Romy is a, a great, uh, great coach, and he always, like, if I have a, a fight coming up, he'll tailor some guys for me, pick some guys for me to help me out. So um, SoCal, man, is just the place to be. Yeah, congrats, Spider-Man. Thank you. Is that a spider web shaved into your head? Yeah, yeah, barely. See, look, look, I got this done like like Monday. It's growing in a little bit, so it's not as clean. I, I need a barber. I need to be able to bring my barber out so he can have it fresh right before the fight. Y'all see that, you know? You need that bonus check. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that too. Four finishes, zero bonuses. Ain't that something? That's crazy. I ain't talking, I ain't talking down or nothing, you know? It's, it's not in my hands. Anything else? No? Going once, going twice? All right.